Hunter's Harvest for Charity has been holding their annual dinner for 40 years, and each year it gets bigger and bigger. Along with a smorgasbord of wild game, including bear, elk, rabbit, and venison, they also held raffles and auctions where people could win some expensive prizes. The men's night out dinner was started by Colonel John S. Boyk, who grew it into what it is today. Sadly, in 2007, he passed away, and his brother Mark took over as president for Hunter's Harvest for Charity. Mark said his brother would be excited about how far the dinner has come. Uh, I, I, I think he's looking down on us and saying, good job, guys. And that's what we want him to think. I had a close relationship with my brother John, and it's just... Uh, just great uh, to, to know that he's looking down on us and I'm sure if we weren't doing good he'd be he'd be up there you know knocking his fist on the table that's the kind of guy he was. Boyk added that for about 20 years every dinner has been sold out. This year they seated 550 people in the ballroom of the Aplex in Alpena. They also broke their record for the most money raised totaling $93,000 that will be given to a number of local organizations. All those guys that come there are from the four county area. So Alpena, Alcona, Presqu'ia, Montmorency. So it's only fair to keep that money in these local uh, communities. And one of the first things we do this spring uh, is we will replenish 15 to 20 food pantries that are in these counties. Um, and we'll put 30 to 40 percent of our net into that area. Other causes they will be giving money to include the Alpino Boys and Girls Club, Baby Pantries, and Vietnam Veterans, as well as helping individuals who may be going through hardships in their lives. Boyk said that it's because of the attendees that they can not only hold this dinner every year, but also help those in need in the area. It's easy to make a lot of money when you have 550 guys, you know, when you're sold out. And as long as that continues, you know, we'll be successful, and that's the only reason we're successful is because of these people that come. As the dinner grows, Boyk hopes that these first 40 years is just the beginning. Reporting in Alpena, Kevin Hodge, WBKB News.